Greetings, friendos and friends. My name is Leah, and um, today what we'll do is go through a pretty brief practice focused on something called sun salutations. So if you've ever taken a yoga class, and even if you've never taken a yoga class, a sun salutation is a really common phrase that we hear in yoga and in the physical practice of yoga. So we'll break that down today. Um, we will go through it and then we'll practice a little bit. And what sun salutations are, are uh, traditionally they were used as a way to warm up the body and create activity in the benefit of serving meditation. So the idea is to move the body and to get all of that energy out so that you can sit still for longer periods. And the sun salutation is a combination of postures linked together with breath and movement. And there are any numerous types of sun salutations, many, many types. And we'll just go over one of those types today. And know that sun salutations um, can be done really slowly, very deliberately with long, slow breaths, inducing a lot of relaxation. And they can be done very vigorously, quickly, moving fast through the postures, through the practice, and that builds a lot of heat, it can build strength and energy, cardiovascular work. So today we'll find something in the middle. And then really what this will be is just a bit of um, instruction and learning so that you could do this anytime. Um, and know that you could do these sun salutations for 10 or 20 minutes and that's a practice. That's a complete physical practice, and you've also gotten a lot of breath and a lot of meditation, a lot of stretching, a lot of movement. So we will do that today. Um, so we'll begin by coming up to the top of our space, to the top of our mats, if you're ha having one or on one, or just you know standing in a comfortable spot. And then bring the feet about hips distance here. So, you know, my hands were there about two fist widths. You may feel sturdy a little further open, but find where you can have the feet almost below the hips and a softness in the knees as you stand tall at the top of your mat. And then just take a moment here. Take a deep breath in, feel your feet on the earth, feel the crown of your head rise up and a long breath out. And then the very first part of this sun salutation, we'll practice our sun salutation A today, is we'll just reach the arms straight up towards the sky. Extended mountain pose, we'll take a deep breath in here, and then on the breath out, start to bend and soften your knees and fold at your waist all the way forward. So the fingertips come down, the head, everything releases. A soft bend in the knees is great here. On your inhale, or bring the hands to the shins. Lengthen the spine, nice bend in the knees as the hips draw back and the crown of the head reaches forward. So take a breath in here, draw belly to spine, and a breath out will fold down. Beautiful work. On your inhale, find your flat back, and on your exhale, fold down here. Planting your hands, then step it back and find a high plank. So take your high plank here for just a moment and always an option to bring your knees straight down. Okay? Find this modified version of high plank still working. Take a deep breath in. And then on your breath out, we'll shift forward. Start to bend into the elbows as you gaze forward. Lower all the way down to the earth. Tops of the feet land. On your inhale, lift your heart. So we'll find a cobra pose here to begin. And then exhale as we lower down. Take your time. Push back up, so you may come through tabletop pose, all fours, you may roll over your toes and find downward facing dog. Take a breath here in your down dog, and a breath out, and then we'll make our way back to the top of the mat. As you're ready, look forward, take a whole bunch of steps, or just one or two big steps, arriving at the top of your mat, and then we'll find that flat back one more time, inhale. And then exhale, fold down, lengthen, keep the length, and then rise all the way up to stand. Soft knees, reach your arms up as you stretch this out. And then bring your hands together, draw them down to your heart. And just pause here 
That's one complete round sun salutation A. There are many variations of our Surya Namaskar, so sun salutation. That's a version you will most often see linking the postures in some type of yoga flow class, like a vinyasa. Some of the classes, a lot of the classes I teach <clears throat> have the sun salutation A as part of their flow. So know that there's a lot of spaces to modify there. So as the, you're in high plank lowering down, the knees can drop straight down. Right? And then as you lower down, whether your knees are up or down, make sure the elbows stay in tight, raising your ribs and pointing back towards your heels. Keep your gaze forward. Right, a long neck here as the heart lowers all the way down. And then tops of the feet land. So I showed the option for cobra. There's also an option for up dog. Lifting the knees and thighs up off the earth. And then moving from either one back into downward facing dog. So lots, lots of options here. And we'll begin to move through this together. Taking one round after another. And We'll start off really slow, and I encourage you to keep whatever pace works. If slow works, if you're looking to really just stretch and open up, take these movements slow and deliberate, and if you're looking to heat up and energize, and you're trying to get the most in that maybe 10 or 20 minutes you're devoting to these sun salutations, move quickly with lots of breath and energy. Okay, so let's go through a few. And we'll start slow and we'll build. So top of the mat we go, feet at hips distance. We'll take a moment to stand in our mountain pose, Tadasana. Take a deep breath. And then as you're ready, soften your knees, breathe in, reach up. And exhale, fold forward. Keep everything really soft here, the breath moving. Inhale to that flat back. Exhale, fold down. Plant our hands as we inhale our way back to high plank. And then your variation, exhale, lower down. Knees up, knees down. Inhale, find your back bend. So big lift in the heart, draw your shoulders back. Exhale, downward facing dog. So maybe coming through tables, have rolling up, take a breath in. Exhale, step forward to the top of your mat, take your time. And then breathe in, flat back, lift halfway, breathe out to fold. Rise all the way up to stand, sweep your arms up. Exhale your arms down to your sides, take a breath. And stay for the exhale, we'll keep moving, inhale, soft knees, reach up. Breathe out, fold down, full breaths. Inhale, flat back. Breathe out, plant your hands, and inhale back, High plank. Exhale into low. And then big breath to draw your heart forward. Cobra, maybe it turns into an up dog. Downward facing dog, exhale. Take a breath in. Exhale, step forward. Inhale, halfway lift. Breathe out to full. Rise up, maybe starting to bring a little more energy in, moving a little faster, breathe out. Arms down to your sides. Inhale, reach up. Breathe out, fold forward. Inhale, long spine, look out. Exhale, fold. Plant your hands, inhale, step back. Exhale, lower down. Halfway, all the way, inhale to your back bend. Exhale, down dog. Take a breath in. Exhale, step to the top of your mat. Here we go, speeding it up. Inhale, flat back. Exhale, fold. Rise up, reach up. Exhale, hands to your sides and keep moving. Inhale, reach high. Breathe out to fold. Breath in, flat back. Exhale, fold. Plant your hands, high plank. Inhale and exhale. Low plank. Pull your belly in. Draw your heart forward, breathe in, breathe out, down dog. Inhale, exhale, step forward. Find your long spine, flat back. Exhale, fold and breathe in to rise up. 
Push down into your feet, reach tall, exhale. Bring your hands to your sides. Inhale, reach up. Exhale, fold down. A few more rounds here. Move with your breath. And then start to let go of my instruction, if you can. Start to just move through this as your body remembers these postures and this flow. And start to see if you can allow yourself to find this moving meditation that comes with this. To feel the breath move through your body, to feel the sensations in your body as you move energy all around. Keep going. We're going to do two more rounds. So wherever you are and however long it takes you, take your last two rounds with lots of intention. Lots of breath. There's no expectations. There's no perfection. Only movement, only breath and energy. I have one more round to go. And then wherever you are, as you arrive back on your feet for the last time, stay there. Draw your hands to your heart center. And connect your thumb knuckles to your heart space. And just take a moment to feel what this feels like, this movement of energy and breath. And just maybe this 10 or 12 minutes we've taken to move your body and drop into the present moment. You can call your practice complete for today and you can take this into every day and all you need is a few minutes and then if meditation's your jam, do this video right before you sit down for stillness and be amazed at the difference this practice makes. So friendos and family, anyone joining, I wish you so much peace and health and safety and wellness. Much love to you all. Namaste.